You're watching Zach Pack TV. All right, here's a quick upload for you guys. Got my daughter here. We're at one of my rental properties, and we have a toilet that's slow filling up. Now, most of you guys know about iron out. Uh, it's in a white bottle with a red cap. This looked gross in here, and I actually vacuumed it out. Um, this is just a quick tip and how to, if your toilet is flowing, my helper here, flowing really slow, you're gonna wanna try to just dump iron out and let it sit overnight. If that doesn't fix it, you're gonna wanna vac turn the water supply off, flush the toilet, get as much water out as you can, take a shot back, or um, some towels and sop all the water up, unless you can get a bucket under here. This is another way to do it, which I could have probably made work, but this was just quicker and easier because I already had it here. And then what you're gonna do is if this head is slow filling, like takes a lot of time to fill up, this thing's clogged full of iron. So get it to where you're dry here, water off, and say the iron out didn't work like it did here in my toilet, um, this is the next step. I'm sorry I couldn't get a tripod in here, but you're gonna remove this nut with your hand or with a pair of channel locks. Okay, I got that off, and now I'm going to take this guy off here. This is another nut, and you're gonna use your channel locks as well. All right, and once you got that nut off, you're gonna have an overflow, which is right here. Um, this is your uh, valve overflow, and you're gonna unhook it from there and lift out. And this makes it super easy if you have a bucket because you don't iron and dirty water all over your floor while you're carrying it somewhere. But here I have a kitchen sink that I'm gonna place my toilet valve in and I got my iron out here so you can see that what you're going to do is make sure you have this stop so it fills up with water and we're going to be uh, dumping the iron out in uh, you don't need to get all scientific with this just uh, do it till the iron off, or it looks much better anyway so that, there you get the point it's just some sprinkling uh, use hot water if you got it. That's going to really help uh, clean that up. And we're just going to fill this up. Getting in there nice and good. Alright, now's the waiting game. Um, I'm going to push this little piece down in there just to help clean it up. I'll set something on top of it. Uh, but your, my valve is like right in here, so this is where it was all gummed up. And what I'm going to do is ever so often just slosh it around a little bit and make sure that that iron out. Yeah. All right, guys, got it back in. Clean as a whistle with the iron out. Um, yeah, I could keep putting some in there just to get that residue out. I might just wipe it down real quick with the probably should have done that before I installed it with a paper towel. But this water was trickling out so ever painfully and the toilet was taking a very long time to fill up. And that's back to normal. It's filling up like it should now. Um, I didn't take a video of it beforehand, but just trust me on that. I couldn't even tell where the water was coming out. That's how slow it was coming out. Um, so hope this video helps. Thanks for tuning in and uh, please subscribe. Doop doop. There's my helpers. Lesson learned, right guys? Yeah. How to fix a ironed up toilet valve. Yeah. <laughs> so amazed.